All right, so what's up guys? So we are out here on another run, out here doing this craziness. For all you guys, simply sit back, watch, and enjoy. And, you know, have some fun with us. All right, have a grand, splendid time. And hopefully, maybe, possibly, change your life. Specifically, things you know, that you could do to change your life in six months. And that's today's video topic. It's four things that will change your life within the next six months. Right, cause an impact, right, divert, you know, what you're doing right now. Right, because we can all make changes. Nobody's perfect. No one's, you know, doing everything completely right. We all have stuff that we need to learn and adjustments that we can make. So, you know, without further ado, we're gonna go to the first thing that you can start doing. And that is reading books, right? So many people don't do this. So many people neglect books. They say that they don't have enough time to read them. Right? Yet, you know, they have time to do other things, right? I'm not saying that they're wrong, but you know, if you really believe that you can do it or really want to do it, which is read a book, you will. Right? And there's different ways of reading, right? It's not just having to sit down, crack open a book, and really, you know, have peace and quiet, right? You can just throw on a pair of headphones and listen to an audiobook. Right? There's so many different options, right? And if you don't even want to sit there and read the whole book or listen to an entire book, you could listen to or read a summary of it, right? The main point, so you can quickly grasp the main concepts of the book that you want to read. So, you know, whether you like it or not, you know, there's different ways and you have simply no excuse, right? As to, you know, not read books, right? Because within the next six months, even arguably faster, right? You'll start to see progress, you'll learn things infinitely. But within a period like six months, you'll see great growth because that knowledge will stack on top of knowledge, on top of knowledge, right? It's like almost like a waterfall, snowball effect, right? You'll start to even realize similarities within books, right? and those will only reinforce the concepts that you know now. And you'll start to read faster and faster. So if you can get through a book in a couple days, right, two, three days, or even one day, if you really push yourself, Imagine how much you could read in six months. Right? It's mind boggling, right? If you're able to push yourself, do that. How much knowledge you'll get from those life experiences of those people, right? Because so many individuals make, you know, we all make mistakes, but so many of those mistakes are preventable. They've been done before and had those people, you know, contain the knowledge you know, from other people going through the same thing in the past, they wouldn't have to deal, you know, with their same outcomes. They would have been all wiser. So, you know, there's a possibility for that. Why not, you know, read a novel, you know, a book of somebody going through the same thing as you, right? If you're a doctor, read some books, you know, by successful doctors, right, or lawyer, right, or whatever you wanna do. Go to the gym and be a professional bodybuilder. There's plenty of different content for you, right, in books. So really do that, really start to read your books and you will become enlightened and your life will change within the next six months. Now without further ado, we're gonna go to tip number two or thing Number two, that will inevitably change your life. And that is, um, you know, if you haven't started working out, you've got to, man. What are you waiting for? And so many people, when they start to exercise, they think that the results 
are gonna come immediately but it doesn't work that way and your body you know has to have its time to grow and change right success doesn't happen overnight and you know there's a specific way to work out specific way to do things right not i'd say like a great majority of people their first day at the gym they have no idea what they're doing right and they're not gonna have you know an effective workout right not quite as nearly as someone who's been doing it you know for over 10 years right five ten years and you know if they had learned from those people and done those same workouts yes you know their results will exponentially increase but even the guy just starting out not knowing what they're doing they could even hurt themselves right if you work out the wrong way right it's definitely not gonna get you the same muscle mass because you're not hitting those muscles the right way but if you start give yourself a period of six months you're gonna pick up new things every day right? and not just you know watch your body improve right which is what we want but you're gonna be able to work out more quickly more efficiently you're gonna start to see yourself push weights more of higher weights easier and better right with better form that's all it boils down to right? just by doing them over and over again right that repetition right which will take you a good six months in order to start to see some significant progress and you know i guarantee you that yes you know the physical results will be the right take your measurements do your before and after and you will start to see those pounds start to shed off body fat go down and muscles start to pop by all through fitness so think about that and you will change your life within six months so another thing that you could do is pick up a new hobby right what are we doing out here we're running and jogging and i'm not running and juggling oh hey we're literally doing two hobbies at once right because we thought that running wasn't enough for us so we had to throw it up we had to mix it up a little bit because we had already been juggling and combining the two only makes magic happen right but so many people you know get too caught up in work and the mentalities of life and they feel that they don't really are able to have you know hobbies right things to look forward to right snowboarding so some people skydiving if you're in the cold it's skiing right there's so many different activities that you could do but you know you have to go and do them i set some time aside and have fun but you're gonna see yourself start to be happier but it feels great to learn a new skill and get good at it right you probably meet some great awesome people right maybe a potential you know partner right not only as a friend but someone that you might even get married to who knows right but had you not picked up that hobby you wouldn't you know, have met them so really consider that right have hobbies that you do right a lot of the most famous successful people celebrities that you see right famous entrepreneurs and politicians have different hobbies nearly all of them right for some it's golf others it's tennis right but they all have something right some it's even chess whatever it is find a hobby because if you're just working 24 7 it'll get old and boring right you want to mix it up so pick up a hobby and within six months you're going to be good at it and start to see your life change and go about things in a whole new light and without further ado we're gonna go into the fourth thing that you could do to change your life okay Whew. and that is you know to save your money so many people don't do this right they literally make 
all their money and spend it all. Right? Or at least try to spend it all, right? The more money they make, the more money they spend. But they don't realize that the more they make, the more they can save and put aside for another day and do awesome things like invest in stocks and bonds and crypto, right? By accumulating that money, you're gonna get more powerful. It's gonna give you options and flexibility, give you opportunities that you wouldn't be exposed to otherwise. Right? For so many of us, you know, we have to, we think, oh, oh man, that we have to spend every dollar we make and so forth. Right? But far too often, that's not the case. Right? Some of the most successful people in the world had to save. Right? They had to start off, they pretty much started out broke, but they built up their money every day, compounding it, raising it, and raising it, and being frugal. Right? That's all it took right? to get to that $10,000, $20,000. It cost them to start their business. Right, because that stuff isn't free. It takes money to make money. And some of the most successful people realize that. So they are very wise with it, very protective of it. And if you save within six months, you can get a decent amount of money saved up, right? At least a couple hundred bucks, thousands of bucks, right? You'll be surprised. Just take a small percentage and save it, right? And keep it. So, you know, without further ado, those are the four things that if you start doing in six months, you'll start to see crazy progress. As always, we say thank you very much and goodbye.